Hey guys, tonight I'm going to be making something that Scarlett in Wisconsin sent us. It's a little breakfast for dinner for us. Um, it's the Swedish pancake mix. It's the Al Johnson Swedish restaurant and boutique, 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 boutique. Um, so I'm going to be making this. She also sent us this um, Wisconsin pure maple syrup. So we're going to try some of that. And this uh, wild Swedish Lingden, Lingden berries. Never had those before in my life. They look like cranberries almost, but so uh, served with sugar. So we'll try that on one of them too. So, that, so these are for later on. So what you need is a big bowl. And the directions actually say to make this up and, and let it refrigerate it overnight. We're not going to do that. It says for best results, let it refrigerate overnight. We're just going to make it and go ahead and cook it. So, so our results may be a slightly different if you refrigerate it, but I don't think it would be that big a deal. So you need the, the batter or the mix. You just pour into a large bowl. And you need three cups of milk and two eggs. Yes, I did say three cups of milk. That's a lot of milk. And then the two eggs. The egg just disappeared. Just you know, it went bloop. It was gone. Okay, let me rinse my fingers off. All right, and it says basically just to mix them up until it has a smooth consistency. So that's what I'm gonna do. So now what we want to do is, is in, an, in a non-stick skillet, which I've got right here, um, it wants to heat it to medium high heat, melt it. You can melt butter or your cooking spray. We're just going to use cooking spray because there's no calories. Um, once your pan is hot, you're going to use a one-fourth um, cup of mix in the pan. Kind of move your pan around to let it thin out and then just let it kind of bubble up and, and you cook it. So. Let's see. Medium high. Okay, so I'm going to take uh, that's really thin batter, just to let you know. Tammy is thinking maybe if you uh, if you let it sit in the refrigerator, uh, it may thicken it up some, which is probably true. So, oh, sorry. So what they mean by spreading it out is just doing this. All right, it's been about a minute. I'm not sure how I'm gonna get underneath here and flip this, so. I guess that's how you do it. It says it only do it for like 30 seconds on this side, which I don't know. It says look for brown spots. I don't, I don't see any brown spots. So anyway, let me get a plate. I'm going to cook up some more of these just like this. Maybe they'll come out better um, as the pan heats up. So anyway, I'm not going to show any more of me doing it. I'm going to do the, the same thing. And if they come out better in the future, I'll show you some more of those if, when they come out better. Okay, the, the next one came out better. You can panic and show it. That's the second one. Um, the pan, I think the pan just needed to heat up a little bit more. Um, they do smell better. They, they have a better smell to them. They're getting a little bit browner. Uh, you're only supposed to leave it for like a minute on one side and then flip it over and and, um, and then leave it like 30 seconds on the other side. So it's not like a, it's a long baking uh, pancake, you know? Oh yeah. Okay, here's our um, 
Are they crepes slash pancakes? <laughs> they're, they're pancakes, but they sure look like a crepe. It's been a long time since we've had breakfast for dinner, so thank you, Scarlett. This uh, this syrup, this is pure maple syrup. It is actually made in uh, Sturgeon Bay, Wisconsin. That is the same place that the Door County uh, coffee and teas are from, are made. Mmm, what is that? Uh, berries, that? lingon berries? Lingon. Ling There's gonna... no D. Lingon. Lingon. There's no D. Lingon. 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 Give him a hard time. Kevin's gonna have put his with the berries. I'm gonna put mine with the syrup. Yeah. Of and course, we're, we're both gonna try. gonna try. Yeah. And there's plenty of mix so we can make more after we review them. When we're not on camera, we can eat like hogs. Okay. okay. I'm gonna go ahead and do mine. Now, normally I would eat my pancakes with butter as well as syrup, hmm. but I'm just gonna yeah, have it with right. the. Oh. The berries are gonna be strong though. Yeah. What? I don't want that big of a bite, honey. I was giving you a good sample of what it was. That is a different texture. Mmm, I like that though. And the berries are kind of a, of a tart. I don't know. It reminds you of a cranberry. That's, uh, I like that a lot. It also reminds you of a tart, like a sour cherry too. Mmm, you'll love that. You'll love that maple syrup. That is incredibly sweet. You might even want more. Cause I was, I went kind of light on it. That's, isn't that good? All right. I like the toppings for both of them. Yeah. I, I like the berries, although I probably lean more towards the syrup. Can't say that I like necessarily the pancakes. They're a little too thin for me. I'm used to really thick, fluffy pancakes, you know? These are these are really really thin. I don't mind this just if you don't call them a pancake. Yeah, I mean they're they're because okay. if you're expecting a pancake, then you're expecting a pancake like we're used to like Bob Evans camp pancakes that type or Cracker Barrel, you know the thick, almost like a piece of cake, you know, uh, very 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 sweet. Uh, yeah, they're th good. I think these are good as long as you don't call them a pancake, then you're not expecting a pancake. Right. Uh, to me, this is more like a, a crepe type thing, but I do like the berries and I really, really like the syrup and I think it's cool that the syrup's from your area. Mm -hmm. Now, I know the, um, the uh, uh, berries. berries aren't, I don't think they are. It seems like they were New York. New York. Okay. But these are really good. I like them a lot. I haven't had uh, anything. No, no, it's a product of Sweden. A product of Sweden, packaged, but it's packaged for, for New, New York. York. Yeah. yeah, and we've never seen that brand before, so this is cool. This was really fun. Mm, I enjoyed it. Thank you very much for sending it to us, and I hope everyone else enjoyed uh, getting to see us eat our breakfast for dinner. We're gonna enjoy more now.